A head-to-head -head battle we can, quite simply, never get enough of. Talk about high profile, this qualifies, and a lot more. Stay with us for complete coverage from Old Trafford. It's Manchester United versus Arsenal. Well, you can certainly feel the excitement tonight here at the Theatre of Dreams, Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, as usual, is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Manchester United, and they take on Arsenal. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out, who will affect the game, and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And a fine tackle. This is the team Manchester United will go with. David De Gea stands between the posts. Bruno Fernandes plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the focal point in attack today is Cristiano Ronaldo. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, here's the replay. What a superb volley this is. He strikes it so cleanly and he times it perfectly. Action underway once more. Let's see if United have the wherewithal to square the game. Cristiano Ronaldo. Possession changes hands. The interception there. Party. Bukayo Saka. It's with Erdogan. And can they prize them open now? Xhaka, superb block. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. A chance to extend the lead. A goal! Accurate from the spot. Well, as you can see, the keeper just stands still and the ball's hit down the side of him. It's a strange one in the end. Second goal for them here. Jaden Sancho. Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes. Here's Sancho. A goal as they cut it to their advantage. Still plenty of life in this match. Well, here's the goal again, and you have to say the patience of the passing is outstanding. They're just waiting for the right time to penetrate, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal.
back in action then and you sense United have the momentum at the moment Jesus a creative look about this options in the centre untidy in possession Diogo Dallo Casemiro Lisandro Martinez Bruno Fernandes and here is Malassia still behind but the pressure mounting will he play it in well a top-notch piece of defensive judgment and under pressure that was a fine claim Thomas that's a lovely ball Saka Cedric it's with Erdogan Granite Xhaka good use of the ball but can they trouble the defence I just couldn't play that decisive ball Bruno Fernandes Partey it's with Erdogan Arsenal's free kick here What an important piece of defending. Well, a wasted opportunity. It would have been a decent chance, but offside the decision. Rafael Varane. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. Well, quite frankly, it's been a struggle for Cristiano Ronaldo, not having anything like the impact we would expect from a player of his calibre, Stuart. Well, it's not been one of his best displays, Derek, has it? He really hasn't been able to affect the game here. Unless he starts getting on the ball... Then... Second half underway, and Arsenal looking to build upon a largely positive first-half performance. He might be able to profit from the wide position. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. And options in the centre. Xhaka. Here's Gabriel Jesus. A disappointing end to the move. Eriksson. This is Varane. Diogo Dallo. Casemiro. Christian Eriksson now. Well, pass after pass. Maybe they can chisel an opportunity. And the defender got the last touch. That'll be a corner. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? United have been getting two substitutes ready and both will come on. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And that's easy peasy for the keeper. Well, the stats tell you everything. They've lacked invention, they've lacked creativity, and they haven't got the ball into the penalty area often enough. 
and that's why they're behind in this game. Now oh, that pass easy on the eye. And he didn't hesitate. Good thing too. Well, he's so quick off his line. That's great goalkeeping, you have to say. Scott McTominay. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Granit Xhaka. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Cristiano Ronaldo. McTominay. And Rashford. McTominay. Terrific piece of anticipation. And he took care of it defensively. Scott McTominay, an effective challenge. Jesus. Martin Odegaard. Bukayo Saka. Arsenal pushing to add to the lead. They've won the corner. And they're making a change. Number 34, Granit Xhaka. Coming onto the pitch, number 25, Mohamed El Nani. Can someone get on the end of this? Nodding it over. Well, he was more determined than his marker, but he just couldn't get it on target, could he? Scott McTominay. Now with Rashford. Cristiano Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes. Now Casemiro. Time is against Manchester United, but it's not over for them. He might yet finish. Time really is of the essence. What can they do from this situation? And with play stop, they will make the change now. Well, just listen to this crowd. They want a bit more. They know there's still plenty of time to find an equaliser. Surely they get another chance. Maybe two. Could cross it in here. Very quick thinking there. Ben White. El Nenny with it. It's with Gabriel. Martin Erdegaard. So three minutes of stoppage time it'll be. The clock is against Manchester United here, but their dreams remain alive. Time is not on the side. This corner could help their prospects as they look for an equaliser. What about the opportunity from earlier? Let's have another look now, shall we? Let's see about the delivery. Well cleared away. Casemiro. Marcus Rashford.
And so there it is, the final whistle, and Manchester United have lost this game, much to the disappointment of their supporters. Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances, could have gone either way, but in the end, they will be disappointed. Well, he kept asking questions, Martin Odegaard. What did you make of what you saw from him? Yeah, not much more you could ask for, really. Plenty of effort, a goal, and...